Hey folks, it's Jiren. Welcome back to Let's Play Victoria 2 with Germany. Great, 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 great. We just captured us with Serene from France last time. So we're still working our way around. What are we going to do? That's a good question, right? What are we going to do? Of course, I want to beat down Prussia, but to do that, I need to get Russia with me. And Russia is a very good military power level, whatever. And that makes it that uh, we can't quite get them with us without them taking control and not giving us what we want and I just realized I completely forgot to grab Elio Glad from uh, Elio Goland from the UK hmm terrible me myself alright so we got a truce with Switzerland right yeah got a truce with Switzerland somewhere around here Germany until 1900 so after 1900, we could consider dropping out Hungary and uh, uniting Austria under our great banner of power and military might. Uh, sure, conservative. All right, we're rolling fast. We got some election going on. We got uh, 3,000 anarcho rebels. Not really a problem. Oh, they're in revolt. Where are they? Uh, right here. All right, have fun. <laughs> I'm not gonna do anything. Seriously, I'm not gonna do anything. Ah, so actually, uh, the Ottoman, the Ottoman are in terrible shape, getting beaten on by Russia and the UK at the same time. Or the yeah, I think Russia is actually on their side. Yeah, they're on their side. Oh well. Hmm, Serbia, we could make Serbia puppet. Nobody cares about Serbia, right? Nobody cares about Serbia. So yeah, let's uh let's make Serbia puppet. Make a puppet. Can we move this stack to Serbia? Will they let me go through? They will not accept. Hmm. I'm in big trouble right now. How am I supposed to go over there? Okay, let's just declare war on them. Make puppet. We'll get five. Uh, how do you call that? Five prestige and Austria Hungary decided to let us go ahead and make puppet out of Serbia. Thank you. The Ottoman entered alliance with uh, Prussia. That's not problematic in itself. We just need to build freaking ironclads. Where are my fort level three? Oh, not my fort. My naval bases. Still 500 days. Uh, what do we want? Yeah, we watch, learn, and observe, and whatever. As if we cared. Alright, crushing the Serbian army. Great. Uh, what do we want? We want plan economy. Yeah, I don't care about plan economy. That's a problem, but I'll still pick it. I'm gonna move some troops around. That's going to be perfect. Yeah, gain 6 prestige. I don't know why. I just gain prestige. That's all I care about. Getting a lot of events. I'm afraid. Uh, I'm really afraid things go badly for us. That will be terrible. Okay, we got a big stack here. 36. Let's move it to Kiel just to get some prisons up north. Uh, Prussia is really problematic. Really is problematic. We'll need Russia on our side. But as I said, we'll need a lot, 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 lots of ships to do that. Alright. Capture that. Uh, oh, Prestige. 
I have absolutely no idea what I said. I think it was about women right or something. But I just seen the prestige. That's all I've seen. Uh, state capitalist. Oh god, everybody wants to vote uh freaking liberal. Nobody wants to vote communist. Yeah, okay. Anything but liberal. That should be what we want. We're still in 95. Okay, let's go grab the steel steamer in that case. We got we got steel steamers. Yeah, I'm gonna so safeguard the capitalist and just defeat the Serbians. Terrible defeat for Serbia again. And they're gonna become a puppet. That's all they're gonna become. Alright. Liberal in power. Yeah, I'm not quite sure about that. I mean, I could let it go. I could let it slip. I don't see it going too badly right now. Just, uh, you know. Ah, we got a lot of investors. And they can still handle everything on their own. Which, you know, I wasn't really paying attention to anyway. So, okay, let's leave it to liberal. That's what the people want. What's the, uh... We're pro-military, limited citizenship, pluralist, SFI, and free trade. Alright. Well, dog is barking, so I'll just go check it out real quick, and I'll be back in a minute. Alright, well, the dog was barking at the cat, so, you know, dog and cat love. Alright, let's bring back our troops home. And let's uh, puppet Serbia. Proceed. And Serbia is now our puppet. It's almost better than just being in her sphere. Can't even influence them for a while, but still, they're in her sphere. They're our puppet now. Ah, uh, Ed Jazz, I don't really care about you people. Oh, we can finally pass them through acceptable school system and all. Great. 61 point is really good. Good alliance from Spain. How good are you, Spain? 171. Who are you nice with? You're nice with uh, Italy and Russia, just as we are. Yeah, that's uh, an alliance to consider. Even though you're secondary power, it's still an alliance to consider. France is at war with Italy and Netherlands. Hmm. I'm going to see what that will give. Netherlands. Oh, Netherlands is a great power. Persia wants to be a ally. Sure, Persia. Of course, we're going to be allied. You're my best friend. In the Middle East. Commerce Raider. Fast Ship Killer. Alright, we're getting a lot of attacks. Is my freaking thingy done? I can't. I still can't build uh, Ironclads. Hmm. Battleship will be cool too. But still pretty far. No, Iron Clouds will be what we have. Uh, relationship. I'm uh, not sure. Yeah, it will be German. Schleswig will be German. Alright. Stop trying to resist. Oh, just seen here. Fort. Fort not built. Forts not built. I need to build forts everywhere. That's how Victoria 2 works. Build forts everywhere. Everywhere you can. And we're getting some clerks in Hanover. Uh, 
What's up with the projects? No projects coming up. You have good production. Producing like uh, over 10% of the coal. You know, a lot of dye. We got good production. Alright, let's do it. Enerit Prussia. Really? Prussia wants to be annexed. Alright. <laughs> Well, that's a quite funny way to acquire Prussia. Ah, look at the Germany finally taking shape. Finally taking shape. Ah, uh, who do we attack next? Netherlands would be sweet, right? They're allied with uh, oh no, they're allied with the same friends as us. Sweden is with Russia. Denmark. Denmark has absolutely nothing. But we have a truce with them at the moment. Hmm. Seems like our uh, internal land power struggle is kind of broken at the moment. Uh. We still got Alsace Lorraine and Prussia. So that's very nice. So uh, let's go and take a look at the infrastructure. So everything is built up. Let's take a look at the naval map. Let's expand everything. Naval bases and forts everywhere. Naval bases and forts everywhere. Naval bases and forts everywhere. That's really sweet. Ah, great. We finally, we finally got real Germany and now we need to build a lot of troops. Let's build a lot of uh, cannons, you know, we need some cannons. Let's build a couple ossers. Come on, ossers. And what's, uh, engineers? Just gonna randomly build engineer a bit everywhere. And two in Asia. Uh, six, twelve, eight, eight, fourteen. Infantry is really good. Yeah, I guess more ossers, bit everywhere. I don't really need infantry since I can mobilize nearly three hundred people, three hundred brigades. So we'll just leave it like that to let it grow and all. I mean. Who the hell can I beat now? Yeah, outfit an expedition right now. I got truces with everyone, right? Diplomatic. You know, I got truces with everyone in blue. Ah, uh, where do I want to expand? I think there's not much choice left. I could go in Asia, but I don't feel like expanding in Asia as Germany. Uh, maybe, maybe maybe USA oh god they spared all of uh, South America that is scary that is totally scary I guess we could just lower the tax of everybody just keep a little tariff and we're running a deficit Let's tax the poor a bit. And we're fine. How fortunate a national tragedy. How fortunate is that? Alright. We got 87% literacy. Let's just review the, uh, the population here. Okay, you gonna get cleared. You gonna get cleared. And you gonna become clerks. And you're gonna become clerks too. So I want big clerks everywhere. You're gonna become clear. I got six top uh, thingy becoming clerks. Six top provinces. We're gaining. We're at 13 million people. We're number two in the world. Only the UK is over us. By how much? I don't know. 
We got every single tech except uh, those of uh, naval trades. So let's work on them. Should be really quick to be done with these. I'm gonna build a navy. I'm gonna build a real navy with uh, ironclads and cruisers and all of that. Liberalism seems to be working pretty fine for the moment being. Russia is still uh, stacking up a large army forces on our border, which can be kind of scary. But they're at war with the UK. In the UK. What is your war, guys? What the hell is your war? East Macedonia. No, really? You guys are fighting for East Macedonia. God damn it. And second, Italian liberation of Lombardia against Austria, Hungary, and France. And seems like uh, Italy is not winning this one. Not winning this one at all. I'm not sure why. It seems to have a uh, pretty good control of their region. Might be more uh, naval wise, I guess. Do they have a? They don't have anything. The Ottoman being walked on in their provinces here. Oh, Egypt, can I still expand in you? Justify war. Acquire state. Oh, they're civilized. Oh, well. It has been nice knowing you, Egypt. It has been nice. Alright, Navy build time reduced. And uh, we just got something from Ethiopia. And someone removed them from our sphere. <coughs> Not sure why. Freaking UK. Alright, gonna stack up and add to sphere again. <coughs> and they're back right where they belong. Uh, what expansion do I want to do? I still have Omen to take on. Justify a war. Establish protectorate. 10 infamy, 128 days. We will do that. We got a big stack here ready for the invasion. It will be short and sweet. And we still have uh, all of these lands to conquer though. Which could be problematic. Unless we get the UK. Let us go. Maybe. Will they be nice enough to let us go? Uh, 8.6 infamy from that. Just to get Omen on our... Well, as a part of integral part of our own kingdom or empire or republic and we just lost position two to the USA really close match we they have uh, they have better industry that's all no oh, and military we got better prestige all right so we got to work our way military wise and prestige wise to catch them up I surely want to be sure to build armors and planes once possible as well as get poison once possible too uh, sure more socialists that's good the Ottoman how well does the Ottoman fare not too excessively good all right and I know about uh, a little trick we could be abusing to reduce infamy if we want. We can actually release uh, nations to get uh, to lose infamy and prestige, but then uh, right after they will petition to join back in. So you know, that's pretty good. And we got a clipper transport app. We will get rid of. <laughs> all right, more liberalism. I don't want to lose any prestige at all. This war is all about prestige. This uh, race to the top with the USA. Our number two is pretty good. And I have no doubt we will soon beat up the UK in no time. <coughs> and I'm coughing again. Alright. Navy build time minus 10. Did we just get a rebellion started? I, I think I heard it, but I'm not sure. Uh, naval organization. Alright, we'll pick it. We don't have anything else. Alright, a lot of money for prestige and uh, the Olympics. And we can Alex Omen. So folks, this says J hopefully you've enjoyed because we just got great Germany. Kind of great Germany. Kind of. Maybe. 
But don't worry, we will beat out Austria Hungaria, build a lot of ships, and uh, force the world to bend our way, which is pretty cool. Alright, so we'll build a lot of ironclads. A lot of ironclads. We'll need a lot of ironclads, and we'll invade Omen. Alright, folks, so this is hopefully you enjoy. Guess see you next time.